Bible. Nagambo mutango go teguliko, teguliko excuses. And it says there is no excuse for paying Oino the price. Kugua. You must pay the price. Nangamba, tu ino kusigala mumuoyo mu ngaba and, na order of Melchizedek. And he told us we must stay in a spirit of unity as the order of Melchizedek. Nangamba, nchikuku utilomulu ndi oguo kubiri. And he told me I emphasize it to you. Musigale mumuoyo mu. Remain in one spirit. Katinganze nebu zebibuzo. So I was asking myself questions. I said, but why is all this? And he told me this. First write down this I'm telling you and I'll tell you. And he told me. Can you, can you take the work that the Lord entrusted unto me? In my absentia. He asked me this question for three times. And he emphasized it unto me and told me, can you be able to stand even before Jesus returns? And he told me this is the reason as to why I'm telling you these things. I've gone through so many battles to see that this ministry remains standing. And he gave me several secrets concerning this ministry. And lastly, in the midst of tears, we're all in tears. I said, but where are you going? And then he made a deep sigh. There is a place I'm going to in America. Where are all the ministers of God go? To rest from all their ministry works. And he told me, but I expect them, they never return. He stood up on his feet. He came to embrace me. In the midst of great sorrow, we in. And he told me. For the remaining things, you're going to come to my home at Munyonyo. Together with three of your friends. And I'll give you the vision of the order of Melchizedek. Vision in Agamba. And for the vision he said, Order of Melchizedek, Order of Melchizedek just to plant altars all around the world. Its major focus is to disqualify all the evil altars. Nagamba, Order of Melchizedek, Erina, Okubera, Timu, Eya, Yachita, Angel Christo, Je. And he gave the same illustration as Jesus chose the 12 apostles. He said each member of order of Melchizedek has to get also 12 around them. Then he said we call a house of Adram. And he said we must make a house of Adulam. Where where somebody has to come after failing in the world and they come to seek Ngaze the Lord. Cheta, gocho, they come to seek the Lord despite any need they have. Chino yasoka, manga, ndina yema this he told it to me while with him in my And he said, but where am I going to get the money from? Nangamba, oinokora sente zizo, otekemu ministre no, ozimbe ebintu bino bigwe. He said, you must make, uh, you must get money by yourself and initiate these things in place. And then his voice was more louder. Jesus Tower. And he said we must initiate the Jesus Tower. Jesus Tower Kuzimba Jesus Tower Christianity. The Lord gave him this vision to raise up a Jesus Tower, which has everything concerning Christianity. Jesus Tower, and he said, 
And Jesus Tower is going to manifest the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. And with all those words, brethren, Pastor Gideon Melinde, and on Wednesday we departed from his home. I was with him, Kawes, together with Kawes, we, together with the wife, Linus, together with Linus, ne Tama, together with Tamar. Nagamba, and he said, I'm saying goodbye to you. What I've forgotten here, he told me on Tuesday, Nangamba, and he said, where I'm going is a journey of no return. And don't expect me back. Brethren, with those words, we as the order of Melchizedek, we as the order of Melchizedek, we bring our sincere condolences but we bring our confidence in Jesus Christ that after Gideon's departure it is the Lord who has taken him I knew it after Angel Melinda called me on Thursday evening she was saying your founding father is dead. And after all, I realized the reality of the words he had told me. So, brethren, shortly, concerning the order of Melchizedek, together with our fathers in God, together with our brethren who are here, in God let us be strong that the departure of Gideon it hasn't been doubted may the Lord bless you all and lastly we bring our condolence from Pastor Daniel of Nigeria. he's not in the nation, he's in Nigeria he's not in the nation, he's in Nigeria he sent, he sent his condolence worth 200,000 shillings. May the Lord love you all.